In order to get a spaghetti plot with the overall trajectory, we can actually use Analyze Fit Y by X. For this example, I'm using a Y in Ratings data set where we have four observations for each of our judges over Y, 1, 2, 3, and 4. We also have additional details about their gender and their expertise, but our main interest will be looking at their ratings across these four wines. Now to first set this up, I'll put rating as my Y, and I'll put wine as my X. We won't actually use judge yet. In fact, once we launch into this one-way output, we're going to designate judge as our matching column. So right now we've set this up. Let's click OK. What jump will return is our standard one-way output. I've actually customized mine a little bit. I have grid lines turned on, and my points are jittered. In order to do the connecting lines, it's actually better if our points are not jittered. So I'll click on the red triangle, go to display options, and uncheck points jittered. Yours will probably be off by default. I'm also going to turn off the overall grand mean. We don't actually need this when we're looking at the spaghetti plot. So I'll go to display options and unchecked grand mean. Now, in order to get the lines connected, that is to connect them by judge, we'll go to the red triangle and we'll select matching column. Matching column lets me pick the column that identifies the groupings, that is, identifies which judge is which. When I click OK after selecting judge, jump will connect the lines between each of the points. So now we have the individual lines or the individual trajectories for each person. Now what we want to do next is plot the grand trajectory. That is the average of all these individual trajectories. In order to do that, I'll go to the red triangle, go to display options, and select connect means. What this will do is connect the means at each point. Now you probably didn't see it added, it actually added one line that is the average trajectory, but it's actually getting lost within the individual trajectories. That is, we want to make that line fatter. So what to do that, I'm going to right click, scroll down and select customize. Customize is an option you have for every graph. It actually gives you additional options for all the different elements in the graph. Now the element we want to change, the layer we want to change, is the connect means line. And what I'm going to do to make it really stand out is I'm going to change the line color to be black, and I'm going to change the line width to be 4. So it's 4 times darker, 4 times thicker than the other lines. When I click OK, Jump will show me now that average trajectory. So going through the cloud of points, of course, but showing the average trend across all those individual lines. I hope this helps.